Even if you aren't an avid Twitter user, you'll more than likely have heard of hashtags, tags, or tagging. While the power of Google enables us to find so many things by simply typing or speaking your question into a search engine, most power users of Google also know about how to use keywords to isolate and refine their search results. Using keywords or tags is a very powerful way to make it easier to find, store, and then retrieve information. I use a tool called Evernote to store all kinds of information. I re <clears throat> I refer to Evernote as my external brain. Now, prior to using Evernote, I used to carry a small notepad with me and would jot down all sorts of information. Uh, and I used to refer to this small notebook also as my external brain. Now, unfortunately, one time I left this notepad in my jacket pocket and went through the laundry. And as a result, I was brainwashed. <laughs> now I use Evernote, which I can access on my iPhone, my iPad laptop, or from a web browser, which has allowed me to capture, store, and retrieve information much more effectively. If I find a useful quote, an interesting article, a great review of a product uh, I want to get, I can easily clip that information from my browser or store the article or a link to the information in Evernote. Evernote prompts me to put the information in a category, which is helpful, but more important, it gives me the option to add keywords or tags to this information that the system will then use when I search for the information at a later time. This tagging is the real power of Evernote and something that I use continuously throughout every day. If or more often when I forget what category I filed information in, I'll simply search a keyword and because I regularly add these tags or keywords to the information when I add it to Evernote, I can easily retrieve what I've stored. Now, for example, just a short while ago, I was listening to a podcast and the participant was talking about a recent article that he had written and he mentioned a key phrase that I knew I wanted to use as a quote. How much life are we willing to give up to forestall death? Oh, wonderful quote. I paused the podcast and quickly searched and found the article and the actual statement and then saved a quote and linked to the article in my quotes category of Evernote. I added the tags life, death, give up and also included the author's name as a tag. Several days later, I was having a conversation with a colleague in Zoom, and I mentioned this quote, and he immediately asked me to send him that quote and reference. My Evernote is always running, so I simply typed the word life into the search uh, category, and the article popped up instantly. I copied and pasted the information into the chat section in Zoom, and also added it to an email, and it was on its way before our conversation was even over. This is the power of tags. The ability to tag information is everywhere. More importantly for you in this course, you can tag information that you put into the forum. The ways that you can use tags and tagging are really limitless. To get you started using tags in the forums, you may simply want to add a tag that will identify the topic or idea that you have been collaborating on or asking for an answer for. Um, for example, in the introduction forms, you'll need to monitor your introduction posts and will have to respond to questions about yourself, what you teach, and how you made the video, what tools you used, um, how you did the audio setup, what mic you used, and so on. So if I were to respond to a question about my audio setup and what mic I was using, I would add the tags audio, mic, and perhaps sound as tags. Adding a microphone would also be a good option, but there comes a point of diminishing returns. I try to add keywords as tags that will help me to find this information, so you will want to use some very common terms. There really is no wrong way to do tags, but if you consistently add tags to your forum posts, and others do so as well, you'll find that searching for information in the forums and finding answers will be that much more effective.